take number one of an interview with Mario Bulfone, who is better known as Mario Milano. Uh, Mario will be speaking with me, Barry York, for the Oral History Project of the National Library of Australia. Uh, the interview is taking place today, the 18th of October 1997. Now, may I begin by mentioning the very nice poem you showed me that you had uh, written. Yes, uh, if you wish, I, uh, I'm not, I'm not, I don't have a very good voice for it, but I can read it for you if you wish. I wrote this in a moment of, uh, I don't know, what you can call inspiration or, I don't know, something, something for something to do. <laughs> <laughs> to remember the old good years and uh, I start like this I say uh, hi lord hello lord I thought perhaps I might make my reservation now for the May event in your arena I heard from you promoters that it will be two out of three with ever everlasting time limit I hear that some of the old great are there up there with you people like Roy Heffernan Easter Calhoun Big Chief Little Wolf, Gorgeous George, Andre DeGine, Skull Murphy, Brute Bernard, Bobby Shane, and all the other great champions. I know that throughout eternity, these men will make a big hit with you, just like they did your honor. A lot of my friends are here with me, Lord, so please take care of them, because someday they will appear in the golden ring of yours, men like King Curtis, Larry O'Day, Tex McKenzie. I expect my friends and I will be there to watch men like Hulk Hogan, Lutes, Dominic Denucci, Killer Kowalski, and many, many more. The most beautiful arena of all, your, uh, your heaven. So you see, Lord, we all know that someday we will receive your call and, oh yes, please, one more request. When the champions Piro Sarion come by, please treat them with respect, because if very men allow follow his footsteps, the world will be in a better place. And after all, Lord, he knows that you are the greatest champion of all. This is Mario Milano, Lord. In closing, I would like to say, if I may, please save a dressing room for heavenly splendor for me. That's very nice, Mario. Very <laughs> Make nice. Me, yeah. Make me... Uh, uh. <laughs> now, obviously, when you wrote that, you were reflecting on your life in a way. Weren't yes, you? I was, and uh, actually, uh, moments I spent uh, writing or putting that together. It's moment when I used to get hurt very bad, and uh, you know, you always have uh, many injuries in life, and rest in life. I mean that sometimes you feel like you're going to die, this is the exit, it's the film, it's in the end. And you know, those moments like that, your, your mind, your, uh, that is the way I, I express, I call my Lord to reserve a place for me when I go.